first off, shout out all the wives up there. As I was about to record, my wife brought me some breakfast. Okay, let's get it. This has been kind of a long awaited video. I've been telling y'all about it for like the past three hundred years straight. Let's get straight into it. If y'all haven't read the title, this is Mitch Darko. Darko. This is the best Urban Outfitters packaging that I've got. The last thing that y'all didn't see, there's like no packaging. Look, it's like fucked up. Okay, my bad, I break up. But this is Michi Darko's Dr. Electric Luxury. Ooh. And this cassette, y'all can see right there. Limited to 400. Oh, come on, that makes it limited to 400. I don't know. I cannot tell you that. It is on a clear cassette. I don't know if y'all can see that right there. Let's get this going first. I gotta be honest with you guys, I do not know much about Mr. Darko. I have heard some of his features, but I do not. Oh, they played it, they placed it. Oh, well, I'm not gonna do that. But uh, I have heard some of his features. But, um. Oi. <gasps> Oi. Excuse me. Like Lindo Summer says, if y'all don't, don't know his channel, go check him out. Lindo Summer on YouTube. Love all the spitting facts. But I'm not gonna cut it unless my unless I run out of uh, battery. Yeah, unless I run battery for another battery on my own um, phone because I'll put like some of my song line to you. Call me crazy, whatever you want. But uh, yeah, what's it called? Uh, I can't go into Michi Darko as much as I do on the other artist. I'm sorry. I'll be honest, I really don't know much about it. I don't. Like I said, I've just heard a few of his features, but even then, I didn't even know they were him. Um, I found out after I looked on Apple Music, you know, I looked on my, uh, oh shit, and I looked on my downloaded and I looked him up, and I had a few features. But, um, yep, you know, I gotta keep the hype, because, especially limited to 400, you know I had to get it. But, um, I saw this, uh, similar to the features, cassette, I, um, I saw this on Urban Outfitters for five bucks. I think this one's a little bit less, like maybe four bucks. But um, yeah. Um, yeah. Let's get straight into my camera. I don't even want to think. More of it. Oh, I see. But this one actually comes like with more stuff on its own. Ooh. Okay, I'll check that out. Right now. Make sure the cassette is fine, cause yeah, if y'all haven't seen the bleachers one, this little room was all the way over here, so I'm not gonna even risk playing that. But um, yeah. Oh, uh, my favorite songs on the on the album were uh, uh, On God with uh, Freddie Gibbs and A Track, the one with Denzel, where, where that boy at? Oh, Lost Lost Souls, that one's crazy. Uh, oh, Proud of You, that one's crazy too. I like that one. Oh, there's the one that I was okay. I was just talking about cuts, guys. I swear, I swear, it's not my phone. It doesn't have that much um, storage. I'm not paying for more storage, guys. On my iPhone 8. Before this one, before I broke it, if y'all don't know the story, I dropped it, it broke. That had unlimited storage. I had every single one of my album songs downloaded, and once I switched to this one, the iPhone 11, because that, the iPhone 8 broke, every single little thing I needed to delete something just to get another. I swear. But uh, let's keep on going. Um, get later and or, get late or die trying. That one's crazy too. The opening gen, uh, curse I mean, because Genesis is just like a little intro, but the way that that goes into, oh, the transitions on here are so clean, bro. So clean. I feel like Mitch Kapp is an underrated artist. Oh, I should just like this. He really loves it. I don't hear people talking about it ever. And, I don't know. Oh, alright. That's sick. Oh, this, this one with Busta Rhymes, bro. Oh, that's the one with Denzel. I'll trip it. Oh, yeah, do that. This, this whole album's good. If you guys haven't heard it, go check it out. The transitions are fire. I gotta admit, he gets a little bit political in some of them. I'm with that, but I'm not with the political stuff. I mean, hey, that preach though. His rapping is good. He's not just talking about, oh my god. He's not just talking about all the uh, negative things that um, most of these other rappers are. I mean, look, he does. He does talk about fucking bitches getting money doing drugs. And that's not easy. I'm not. I'm not. I'm sorry, last time. I'm gonna just wrap this up before I um, what happened again. Thank you guys for joining me. This has been Mitch Darko's cassette unboxing. Limited up 400. I'm so excited for this. I'm so glad I found out about him. If y'all haven't checked this out, go check it out. Such a good project. The production is clean, fire, and spits. It's good as album. This has been Mitch Darko, guys.